Some people absolutely adore the roosters while other people despise them. In this video, I'm going to be giving you a couple things about roosters that might make you hate them a bit more than you already do. So let's go. All right, so we're gonna start off with something pretty simple. It's re leading the chickens in the wrong direction. At the end of the day, roosters have basically the upper hand against all the other chickens in their day-to-day -day routine because he's the one that's supposed to keep them in charge. Now, some roosters, like my rooster Waldo, who's up there, I might show you him later, um, they, they all follow him because he's a respectable rooster. These chickens follow Falcon, but he's not as, like, credible as Waldo is. So he'll take them in inappropriate directions, which will lead them to potentially life-threatening situations, like with Chicken Burger. Falcon will occasionally escape, and the chickens will follow him, which is an unfortunate sign of roosters, because at the end of the day, they're the ones that are basically mapping out the chicken's day-to-day -day routine. But on other occasions, he's just your chicken being an absolute dumb idiot. So I want you to take a look at my chicken Summer right there. I want you to know something about her back. Do you notice how it's stripped of all her feathers? That's because this rooster keeps mating with them. Most roosters are fairly tame when they mate with their chickens. Because the way they mate is they jump on them and then peck at like the top of their head. Which is why you might notice not only are they losing feathers on their back, but they're also losing feathers on their head. So, roosters are quite annoying. Most roosters, like my rooster Waldo, is very tame with that sort of stuff. Like, I'll only notice a couple missing feathers, but my rooster Falcon has to do it like 75 times per chicken per day. So, the chickens lose their feathers pretty quickly. But he only does it with certain chickens, which is why my chicken, like Grey Cloud, still has complete feather cover. But my chicken, like Loudmouth, over here, well, she still has good feather cover, but Burnt Chicken Tender is losing feathers. This is one of the main reasons why people <clears throat> deter from roosters. It does have a slight solution. I don't want to say it's a major solution because they'll still rip feathers off of their head. And there isn't really much you could do about them other than like maybe trimming their legs to stop them from tearing feathers off. Not legs, nails, because they have really sharp nails. And also spurs as well. That'll also help protect you. Now another thing is dominance. Now this is really going to be short because some people don't even have only have one rooster in their flock. Now, there, if there's two roosters, a lot of the times, if you have two or more roosters, usually it's... Oh, sorry. Lovey, you're not supposed to be following me right now. This is supposed to be professional. But um, if your rooster's following you, like, not really following you, sorry. That, that chicken following me really threw me off there. But um, if you notice that your roosters are constantly fighting, most of the time, the secondary rooster, really, the second whale there, is really only because... Like, they, they were in, not intended, like, Falcon should have been a hen laying eggs by now. Should have been a green queen hen laying eggs. But no, it has to be a green queen rooster. Two-thirds of them were roosters, unfortunately. So, yeah. Take that piece of advice with a pinch of salt, because some roosters are really good friends, and others absolutely despise each other. Good examples like Waldo and Snow White from last year. Snow White's demise was over almost a year ago. That's actually amazing how long ago that was. But, <clears throat> taking that in, Snow White was always losing battles until Snow White beat the ever-loving crap out of Waldo for months, until mysteriously he vanished. But, that, that's a whole video on it in and of itself there, so I won't get into too much detail. But, roosters are just like that. They will destroy each other and can injure themselves. Which is why we gave away shaving cream and worried that rotisserie chicken would also do that. We also gave them away to a different family nearby as well. Now this is a part you really need to pay attention, maybe even take notes from. Roosters can lead to serious injury and occasionally even death. Although that's very rare, it can happen from separate issues. I wanna show you my rooster really quick, Falcon. He's a really well-built rooster, except for the fact that he weighs like 85 pounds. Like, he's a really heavy rooster. Which, if you notice, his spurs are pretty well-built. He also has a pretty well-built beak that allows for him to be able to attack anything or anyone that's coming on there. Now imagine, you're just in the chicken yard, I don't know, maybe checking the weather. And, um, yeah, you're just in there maybe checking the weather, talking to your chickens. Or maybe your friend about how oh, it's gonna be 72 degrees today, perfect day to get outside and do some work. He can misinterpret that and just start jumping at you. So, this is going to be a very serious thing for some roosters. And I will say, he, w on top of making obnoxious sounds, he'll use these things to his advantage. And it's, he wrecked one of my pajama pants once. That's 
And he's also um, rammed into me on a couple occasions, but really sucks at doing that. But I will say when roosters do that, they will injure you. And if you're not careful about the wounds, because he can open up some major wounds if he's really careful with what he does. Because if he plays it really correctly, he can really open up some wounds, which yeah, can be really serious. And if you don't treat them correctly, it can lead to deadly infections. So be very cautious with what you're doing with your roosters. All right, so I got two videos up for you on a screen right now. Click them, click one of them at least, you can't click two. Unless you really want to, obviously. But yeah, please consider liking and subscribing if you found this helpful. And if you wanna see a sequel, which is talking about why I would like you to have roosters, please consider liking and subscribing.